A parasite in northern Europe is attacking brown trout and could have serious consequences here in the United States. I spoke with graduate student Becca Colby about the study investigating this problem. This study looked at Tricapsuloides bryosalmini, which is a parasite that is really close related to jellyfish. So it's sort of like this tiny little jellyfish that starts out in a worm and then gets released into the water and ends up inside of a fish and embeds in their kidney. This parasite causes proliferative kidney disease inside the brown trout, a disease with an 80 to 90 percent mortality rate. Kidney cells multiply and the kidney ends up becoming very large um, and it can't function properly so it takes up the body cavity and sort of smushes other organs. As if this disease isn't bad enough, climate change is allowing the parasite to affect more fish than ever before. So the parasite, because of increased water temperatures, is beginning to invade into new areas where it wasn't previously found. On top of more parasites, climate change affects how the fish fights off the disease in the first place. With warmer waters driven by climate change, fish with PKD are going to have a harder time. And if waters warm to the point where fish can't tolerate it anymore, fish with PKD are going to be the first ones to go. Overall, this parasite mixed with climate change is bad news for brown trout. With this parasite present here in North America, what could an increase in its population mean for us? We put a lot of money into raising these fish so that people can catch them and so that people can eat them. And if we're releasing these fish into waters where they're going to get this parasite, that's not a great use of our money. While the parasite is here in North America, Colby says there's currently no research being conducted Research we need if we're concerned about our fish and ultimately our economy. For UCTV News, I'm Julia Gorman.